Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. Hope you all are doing good. Today I am sharing a cooking vlog with you all. Hope you will like it. In this vlog, I will be sharing a visit to my uh, small vegetable garden and lunch preparation and then a small tea time. So after uh, breakfast, I have come to the, my small terrace uh, garden uh, to water the plants. I usually water it in the morning and if it is too sunny, then I will water in the evening also. And then I have to, I am just, I just wanted to see whether I will uh, get any vegetables to prepare lunch. So today we have uh, the Amaranthus green. We call it uh, Pacha Chira. I didn't sow the uh, Amaranthus green seeds now. It was already, uh, long back I had it in my garden. And from that time the uh, seeds will fall into the grow bag. And when the rain comes it will grow. So recently we had very good rains and two of my grow bags are full of uh, Amaranthus green. That's what happens. It will grow flower the seeds will fall into the grow bag and when the rain comes it will grow so it just stays in the garden and the uh, this many purple brinjals i have got so it's nice to have a small uh, vegetable garden we can have once in a while we can have some uh, vegetables and make lunch it's a great uh, uh, joy Today is a holiday, so I thought of buying some fish for uh, lunch. It's just walkable distance from our apartment, so I just want to buy some fish. First, I'll cook the rice. I'm using Sona Masuri rice. Just, uh, just boil it in water and it'll cook off fast, no? So usually uh, I uh, use uh, both Sona Masuri and also Matta rice. Now I am making uh, Chira Thoran or this um, Puriyal. Um, we cook it with uh, coconut. Usually with this Amaranthus green I will make this recipe only. I don't know other recipes. So first oil in the pan, mustard seeds, when the mustard seeds uh, splutter, we will add urad dal, this will give a good taste to the uh, puriyal. Now into this chopped uh, garlic and uh, chili, saute it and add the uh, Onions chopped, salt to taste, turmeric powder and then we will add uh, some grated coconut, saute it and then we will add the chopped amaranthus green. With other types of green I make curry with uh, using dal dal and mixed uh, greens but with this type of greens I usually make this chira tori. Now we will allow it to cook I've got on sliced slow butter flame. fish from the uh, shop. So I am uh, mixing it with crystal salt and basin and I will allow it to uh, uh, rest for some time and after that I will wash it with um, water several times and it becomes really clean. Now uh, with the brinjals I am making um, potato brinjal roast cutting it lengthwise and into long pieces. Now the chira thorin is ready. I will be using the same uh, pan to make the potato brinjal roast so that I don't uh, pile up many vessels for wash after the cooking. So to make the roast here I have taken uh, two medium sized onions, five to six 
cloves of garlic and a small piece of ginger. We'll crush the garlic and ginger. And I have taken uh, three medium sized potatoes and two uh, tomatoes. Into the oil we'll add mustard seeds. When it flutters into it we'll add the chopped onions and the crushed garlic and ginger. Saute it till the raw smell goes. Add curry leaves also. Once it is sorted, we'll add the red chilli powder. One teaspoon heaped of red chilli powder, a little turmeric powder and a spoon of uh, coriander powder. Saute it and after that we'll add the chopped tomatoes. Add salt to taste. And then we will close this and cook till the tomatoes become soft. Once the tomatoes become soft, we will mash it a little and into this we will add the chopped potatoes. I have chopped the potatoes lengthwise. Now we will saute the potatoes for some time. Fry it for about 2 to 3 minutes and then into this we will add the chopped brinjal. Stir it well and then add some water and we will cook it for some time till the potatoes become soft. Now the fish is, I have cleaned the fish and I have separated into um, for frying and for curry so today I'll be just frying the fish so to marinate I have taken chili powder turmeric powder ch uh, crushed ginger and garlic pepper powder salt that's all that is uh, that's all for the masala for fish fry Now our brinjal and potato roast is almost ready. The potatoes are well cooked. Into this we will add uh, a quarter, half teaspoon of garam masala. I use homemade garam masala and uh, stir it well. And if any water is there, let it uh, reduce and uh, roast it and take it. Switch off the flame. We can add uh, coriander leaves if required at this time. Now we will fry the uh, fish. I use cast iron uh, pans to fry the fish. If the pan is uh, oiled well after each uh, wash and uh, keep, then the fish won't stick. Now it's time for lunch. It's nice and um, we feel a, a sense of happiness when we can make uh, food from our own garden. I'm mo I have not made any curry because uh, anyway my son wants curd. So I thought okay today we will just um, have curd for uh, rice. So the lunch is ready. In the evening it started raining heavily, really heavy rains and my son wanted uh, tea. So I thought of making banana fritters to serve with tea. Only one Nendran banana was left so I mashed it well and uh, added two tablespoons of coconut grated, one and a half tablespoons of sugar, two tablespoons of Maida, 1 tablespoon of rice flour, salt to taste and make it into a batter using some water. Uh, I feel uh, some uh, more maida is required so I have taken 2 more tablespoons of maida and into this we will also add some 
uh, cumin seeds or uh, jeera for flavor so by the time the tea is ready we can uh, prepare the snacks also such an easy recipe it's a very common recipe uh, you would also be making it at home it's nice to have a hot hot fried snack with tea when it's raining outside I don't take tea so it, the tea is only for my uh, son and the banana fritters are ready the tea is also ready then i had some uh, needle work which i have been doing for a very very long time so i thought okay i'll sit down and um, uh, s do the needle work for some time and have a chat with my uh, son so that was the evening today and hope you like the vlog which i have shared i think this is the first time i'm sharing this type of uh, vlog in my channel uh if you liked it please do press the like button and please give your suggestions as to uh, what is your uh, opinion about this uh, vlog thank you for watching take care bye